To help you segment your users, you will be able to create custom user fields as well as tags. You can do so in two different kinds of ways. You can do so from the contents tab on the left hand menu, go towards the user fields tab on the top, and you will be able to create a new user field by pressing the blue button on the right hand side. You can give the field a name, and on the right hand side, you can determine the type of user field this needs to be. If we press the drop down, you will see that you will have a selection from text, number, boolean, date, date time, and JSON user fields. You can select any of these towards your own liking and your own preference. And you can also give the user field a description if you want to create a template and you want to give a little bit more description about what this user field does, then you will be able to do so as well. You can also assign this user field directly to a folder if you have created a folder. If you don't have a folder, just press save and you will see the user field being created and displayed in the main user field overview. Just like with flows, you can also create folders inside of user fields. To create one, just press it, give the folder a name, press create, and from here the folder has been created. If you want to add this specific user field towards the flow, just go towards the pen icon on the right hand side, and then select the folder. And you will see that the user field has been removed from the main overview, but it is now moved towards the folder user fields. Besides going towards the contents tab to create your user field here, you can also go directly inside of a flow and do the same. If we go back towards the flow overview, go towards any kind of flow that you like to, we can save the response to a user field. If we press the drop down, you will see all the available fields. We have the system fields and we also have the custom user fields. But if you want to create a new user field directly on the spot, you can type any kind of name. Just press the name itself that displays below. And you can select the custom field type here. So either text, number or boolean. This way you can create user fields directly when building a chatbot instead of going towards the contents tab first.